All right, there's a good chance you've heard this all the time growing up. I know we certainly did. Absolutely. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. That's right, what our mothers used to say. Yeah. All right, this is National Breakfast Week. And as Megan Pringle reports, a group of advocates and educators is using this time to get more food to kids who need it. Some might consider it a breakfast of champions. School administrators and advocates looking to champion for free breakfast at schools. We all know as adults that we need to start our day off in a positive way with a balanced breakfast. We need to do that for our children. There are about 200,000 students in Maryland who qualify but don't eat a school breakfast. I don't, there's no real one solid answer to that. Um, I think every situation is different, but when you're working in school nutrition as I do, I mean, you can definitely see it. Only a few Maryland districts take advantage of state and federal programs to provide meals. What we moved to was a program where we provide breakfast and lunch to all students at no cost. So there's no more filling out forms. Every student in our county comes in, receives a breakfast and a lunch, and it has made a tremendous impact in our county. According to the organization, No Kid Hungry, there's better success rates for kids who have breakfast. For example, they have have better attendance, and they're 20% more likely to graduate from high school. Former Raven Quadra Ishmael is part of Fuel Up and Play 360, a program that promotes physical activity, which can't happen without a good meal. It's not only just the eating, but it's also about getting out and committing at least 60 minutes a day to helping yourself function as a human. The goal today is to share ideas and come up with solutions, a little food for thought they hope will eventually go a long way. In Annapolis, Megan Pringle, WBAL-TV 11 News. See what she did there, a little food for yeah, thought.